Three, two, one. Good day everyone, Garage King here and welcome to the Snap-on December 2024 sales flyer of the month. I'm hesitant to say if this is the Christmas flyer because usually we get one more flyer somewhere early December. I'm hoping that happens again this year. It's still November. I'm getting this flyer out early, so I'm hoping we get one more. Let's see. Let's check out Snappy's workshop. All right, let's get right into it, guys. So first things first, the North Pole ain't got nothing on us, and they're saying, you know, where all their tools are made, so a little bit of advertising here. But let's pan over here and see what they got. All right, now I'm kind of interested in this because you can buy any plier set, all right, or a file set, or a half-inch drive ratchet, and you get this Sherpa-lined hoodie. So that's pretty good, and I think that's, uh, you know, Snap-on clothes is pretty good as far as I know. They, they actually have uh, pretty good branded wear items, so I'm actually kind of interested in that, and I do have some of their pliers. I absolutely love them, and I don't have this set, so I may inquire, although I do think I have this pair of plier in particular. Anyway, let's keep moving on because that's just buy get. So here when you buy a CT9050 cordless, you get a lug nut socket set. So I don't know if that's the best deal. They got some more wish deals here. This was kind of interesting. You know, when you buy a Blue Point General Service set, you can actually get this blender, this immersion blender. So make, maybe you can make some, some Dairy Queen blizzards or something out of there. So I don't know, that one actually, I've never seen anything like that before from Snap-on, so I figured I would mention it. Up over here, we got the pry bars. So if you buy some pry bars, you buy a four-piece pry bar set and a 42-inch, then you get the 36-inch, which is the three-foot. That's expensive, and I know their pry bars are quite a bit. So this should be the 36-inch pry bar. I do have it. Uh, I use it quite a bit. As you can see, it's quite beat up. And it is, uh, it's massive. And uh, really, I don't know, the 42 inches has got to be pretty big. But 36, I don't know if you need much more than a 36 unless maybe you're a heavy-duty mechanic. What else do we have here? Buy a screwdriver or plier set, get a snap-on kid's play mat. Well, I do love their screwdrivers, but, you know, I don't know about the play mat. There's, there's what the play mat looks like. So kind of interesting. And here, if you buy some files, you can get a kid's writing board. They got some pots and pans there and a nice uh, toy, I guess, uh, a rocking toy. So that would be kind of interesting, but that's how to win. So you're gonna have to enter for that. So not for sale, that's to win. What do we have next? New products, I always like going over the new products because it always gives me ideas of things to buy. So creeper brake, I haven't seen a creeper brake before, so it is something that's new. You gotta have 2.5 inch casters or more, I suppose, and it's a locking bar that goes underneath your creeper. Now. I am tired of running over my air hose and always having to try to sort of move myself around. But this thing, if anything, I don't know how well it'll work. It actually might get in the way. If anyone has bought this and anybody in the trade has, you know, already purchased this and it works, please let me know because it's a very intriguing product. I just don't know if it's something that'll work or if it's something that's going to get in the way. Next up here for a new product, we have uh, electronic interchangeable bit mini screwdriver set. And that is 182, so not cheap. That's what it looks like. What do we have over here? We have a light for your head, and it is $138. Probably a million times better than the cheap one I got from Amazon. I tried to, you know, save money, bought this one, and actually it's junk. It, it gets really hot, and it just doesn't even last long. After about 30 seconds, it dims, so absolute junk. Good thing I didn't do a review video on that and say it's good, because it actually isn't any good. Now, next, uh, next up here, we have some adapters. Here's a striking adapter. You can see there's the price for those, new tools. And here, I don't really think it's a new tool. It's just kind of a new set that they cobbled together for $115. It's a Blue Point uh, drill uh, and driver set. Let's pan over here and see what we have. Now, this is interesting. I wanted just to discuss it just, you know, a little bit. Anyway, there are three eighths drives. You get up to $100 off with trade-in. So take the old drill that you ran over with your tractor and just doesn't work anymore and get this new one. So you're going to get at least $100. Uh, 100 off, but still 745, so still quite pricey. And this one here, it's 1200, but that's for the kit, and you get two batteries and a charger. Now, if we pan down here, $70 off, you can see 565 for just the tool. So it lets you know how much those two batteries and the chargers actually work. Here's what's interesting here's the air tool, here's the battery, all right, and it's 18 volt. Now, if you look at the breakaway torque, you can see the air tool actually supposedly is supposed to have less but the torque output, it's actually got more. So it's kind of interesting because I still, you know, favor my air tools over electric, although I do have one electric one and I saw it on the torque test channel that did really well. It was a Chinese CC brand. And this one does really well. Now it's rated at something crazy like, 
I, I don't know, 700 foot pounds. But the strange thing is my air tool that's rated at less will still pull off more than this will pull off in, you know, if something's really tight. But overall, it works great. I'm just saying. A anyway, so I sort of do lean towards air tools. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, these are just, oh yeah, as I mentioned earlier, that's just the tool only. Let's just keep moving on. Don't want to bore you all with that. All right, so ratchet effect. So now we have their wrenches, and these are the ratcheting wrenches. So they're one way, so they're not reversible. You can see there's no uh, switch to flip there. Now in my wrench drawer, for the most part, I use just regular wrenches. I did get a set. Now these aren't snap-ons. Uh, they do swivel at the end, and to be honest, I barely ever use them. I have a few here that uh, that are fixed. They, they don't sort of have a swivel or a flex end. But the only one I, I find I really use is probably the 12 millimeter, and I use that one all the time for brakes. But other than that, I don't really use them that often. But let's go through the prices anyway for you. So for a seven-piece set, we are looking at 418 down from 464, and that's 3 eighths to 3 quarters, so that's SAE. And then we can get the big boys, 13 16 to an inch, 458, you're only going to get four of them. And then we go down here, uh, this is basically the same as uh, this one, except it's just a metric, that's why it's not shown. But it's 600 bucks from 668, but it's a lot, it's 10 to 19, so you're, you're getting quite a few wrenches there. And then you can get the big set as well, which is a 21, 22, and 24, and that's 340. Uh, here's another one that's not shown. We keep panning down, and here's one for 660. Again, includes 10 to 19, not shown. Now, the difference between these is if you read, these are just flank drive non-reversible, flank drive non-reversible. These are flank drive plus. So they, they do have the flank drive plus. And those are the prices, which are very similar to the other ones, you know, metric or imperial. I just don't know if they're worth that 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 kind of money, you know. And obviously, this is what they look like. So, yeah, they're gorgeous looking wrenches. And there's seven piece uh, zero degree offset, and that is three sixty seven. That's uh, eight to fourteen mil, three sixty seven on sale. It is not shown. And then they have a twelve piece. This one is blue point, mind you. It's not snap on. It's still four eighty, and it's eight to nineteen. They got another blue point down here. 8 to 19, and that is 446. That's 15 degrees, so it's not zero degrees like that one. Here we have, just tell us about your idea. Snap-on, I'll give you $3,000, and they're going to make millions. I think I've told you before, I do have an idea, and I'm so lazy. It's been like a year, and I've still never mailed it in. Someone's going to dream the same dream I had and mail it in and make all this money if I don't hurry up and do it. So I'm really going to have to get on it one day. All right, next up, what do we have? This is kind of interesting, and I don't know if it's a good deal or not, but... It is, it's down from 1570 all the way down to 1335. So not a huge drop, but you are getting some off. You're getting a mixture of quarter drive and three eighths drive uh, sockets. And you're getting actually quite usable sockets here if, if you look at the sizes. They're, they're actually fairly decent. Unlike this one over here, where for 605, it's a blue point. Um, the quarter drive, Kate, that's fine. Three eighths drive, that's what's included in the three eighths drive. But the half inch drive, I don't think you're going to use a lot of these half inch drives. Some of the bigger torques, yes. But for example, for the metric hex big sockets, 10 to 19, for half inch drive, uh, a 10 millimeter, I, I don't think you're going to use it. All right, so let's move along to the next page. So now for here, we got these long ratchets here. So save up to forty dollars with your with your trade in. So these ones both the they're not shown, and you can see the price five ninety five, five fifty five. You get forty dollars off, and I think one's just a long neck. So yeah, long neck. Uh, but these are tool only, and there is a picture of the ratchets. There you get up to eighty dollars off. These ones are going to be a little bit pricier, I think, and that's because these ones should be kits, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, kits. So nine ten and nine fifty respectively. So with the kits, usually then you should get the batteries. If we look up here, there you go. Yes, so kit tool includes two batteries and a charger. So that's why you're going to get a little bit more off, um, you know, when you're trading in. But I still do think that is quite pricey. Although it's really nice for a ratchet not to have to lug an air hose around. Next page, hammers. A lot of good stuff I hear about hammers. And to this day, folks, I still don't have a good hammer. Well, this one's not bad. It's like a fiberglass handle. It's probably 40 years old from my dad or whatever. But anyway, I still use it. I do have a blue point though. 
And this one I really like, it's just a blue point. And, and this one's actually good for doing like little kind of stuff. So I do like it, but I would like to get one of these. But the problem is if you look at the ball point or, or ball peen hammers, they're still quite pricey because for 56 ounce, there you can see 226, 40 ounce is 190 and a 16 ounce is 124. Although they try to make, you know, they try to make you feel a little bit better because you can get, uh, you know, all these colors in it. Anyway, that's just what it is. And then they have the, the dead blows here, 193 and that's for 56 or 115 and that's for 32. I do have a dead blow hammer because as you know, when wheels are stuck on, you don't want to damage the rim. So dead blow works really good. For me, mine is, I think uh, it's a three pound dead blow hammer. I don't know who makes it. I definitely didn't pay a lot of money, but it does work. It's just a dead blow hammer. But in order for the ball peen ones, I think I'm, I really would like to get a snap on one. For the dead blow, I guess I'll just keep my cheapy. Let's go to the next page, everyone. What do we have here? All right, now this gets a little bit exciting, okay? Now this isn't on sale, but I haven't seen this thing before. It's like a secret, it's like a secret thing here. So it's a collapsible magnetic dish with a lid on it. So I'm excited for this because I like uh, the dishes, obviously. They look like a little dog bowl and they collapse right down. So you gotta love them. And I do use it all the time. I use this thing all the time. So I'm actually thinking of buying this one, believe it or not, for 50 bucks because I can close it up. I don't know why, it's just, it's just calling my name. So I think I may buy that one. Uh, there we got some gloves for just over $50. Uh, some of their basic scan tools there. These are Blue Point, 695 for this one. And this one is 492. Can do some scanning for you. We have a digital tire tire inflator right there, and that is 314 for the digital tire inflator. What do we have on this page? Well, we got a smoke machine. There's no price, so it's uh, probably going to be pretty pricey, guys. And that is it for the flyer of the month. We're ending off with a nice toolbox. I'm really hoping that Snappy will give us another Christmas flyer very soon because they're. To be honest, there wasn't a lot in this one. Maybe the hammers, um, there just wasn't a lot. I, I, I thought, to be honest, there was gonna be more for Christmas time. So I'm, I'm hoping we get another Christmas flyer. Anyway, that's it for now. Any questions, comments, please leave them in the comments below. Uh, Garage King over and out, and I will see you again very soon. Thanks.